guys, Profe Pablo here, Spanish teacher turned Minecraft engineer. Guys, here we are back in the survival world. I'm playing this world as if it is hardcore. In other words, when I die, I die. I also have some packs on this world, which means we have brown bears, a witch tower, and mobs do not burn. All those packs you can download at ProfePablo.com. Guys, we do have a problem though. I just got in this world. It is updated to 1.18, which is great. But that means I really want to go see the new world generation. So we are going to abandon this village, our tree farm. We're going to release these villagers. Let me go do that real quick. I wonder if they're still alive. And they are. Be free. Uh, I could take some of this stuff with me. I don't need gravel. I need dripstone. don't really need all those slabs, so I'll leave those behind. I think I'll take a stack of wood with me, though. Uh, guys, the problem we have is that with the new world generation, it deleted my witch tower here. So I'm hoping that it'll pop up in other places. Otherwise, that means my witch tower add-on broke. I don't think it did. Um, but we're going to leave that behind as well because it's not there anymore. So we are just going to be heading east. I really am excited about this new world generation. I've seen so many cool things. Oh, do I have food? Yeah, I got potatoes and apples. I'll be fine. It's a good thing I didn't build my iron farm yet. That would have been really annoying to build an iron farm and then have to, like, leave it behind. Okay, let's let's go this way. I feel like this river's bigger than the other rivers. I guess I haven't made it this far yet. Whoa, there's a witch tower. So, should we try and <laughs> invade the witch tower? Probably not. It's cool, though. Okay, and we made it out to an ocean. I would love to stay by the ocean, but um, I really want to see new world generation, so we're going to keep traveling. That's a pretty big mountain over there. One of the things I like about the new world generation is the beaches are bigger. I really like that. Also, rivers are bigger. I don't know if you've noticed. Okay, it looks like a mountain is forming right there. That's awesome. That's oh, huge. All right, let's go check that out. Oh, that's a new glitch, by the way. They need to fix that. Uh, boats disappear. And it's getting dark. Did I bring a bed? I did. Let's go ahead and sleep. Oh, can't sleep. Must sleep. Must sleep. All right, now I saw a mountain over here that was being formed. I like kind of these sloping hills that kind of slowly go up instead of like the steep thing that we used to have to deal with. It does make it easier to climb a mountain. Okay, I'm liking this mountain. Uh, it's not like a mountain mountain, it's more like a big hill. Still very cool though. It's so funny working without coordinates. It's like, uh, why, why does it even matter where I'm going? Okay, uh, I'm kind of looking out, seeing some more stuff. I'm going to keep exploring. Okay, because of the disappearing boat trick, which I hate. Uh, I only have one more boat. I thought this was an ocean. It's not. Okay, I really do like the new world generation. It's very cool. It's kind of hills falling into the ocean or river or whatever we're in. Definitely feels more natural. Oh, no way. Look at that village. Okay, we, we, <laughs> we are setting up shop here. That's awesome. Look at that village. It's like spread out over these hills. Hope this is a living village. All right, let's go protect some villagers by locking them in their homes. We do have a golem. Golems are good. This is an awesome village. Okay, I, I need to get some wood or something. Because these guys don't even have professions, so... Oh, now they're getting professions. That's good. Oh, I have a stack of wood. What am I doing? All right, I'm going to put throw these guys into boats, I think. Although they should all go to bed once... 
Nighttime comes, nighttime's coming. <laughs> Look at that guy on the edge. He is living on the edge. Look at him. Now, let's see if I can nudge one of these guys into a house. Nope. Okay, this guy's pathfinding this way. Okay, so we'll have one guy locked in there. This guy needs to find a bed. There we go. Guys, when you come to a village, this is one of the first things that you need to do. Oh, dear. Um, it just helps. These guys are trying to pathfind their way to different beds. Okay, at least we know two guys are safe. The rest should be safe as well. We'll see about that. Let's go explore the rest of the village. Oh, awesome. We have a mountain over there in the distance. I'm really liking this location. Okay, we got some unknown maps going on. This is a big house. Okay, I am going to throw this guy into a boat. I want to take him down there somehow. Did he survive? He survived. <laughs> All right, and now that he's here, I'm going to protect him by adding on to this house. Okay, I do need to throw a torch in there so nothing spawns. Okay, so we have safe villagers. We have a new base here. Okay, guys, I am really excited about this brand new village on our survival world. When I come back next episode, I'll be redoing a tree farm and mining down and see what's below us. Thanks for watching.